There's a new type of computer spying on the rise. And it's ooh, really creepy. On this Upgrade Your Life, hackers who get remote access to your computer and look for webcams they can use to spy on you. It's called ratting, using remote access tools, or rats, to gain control of a victim's computer. Once a hacker has access, they can completely control the device. What's on the rise is an online community of voyeurs who turn on the webcams of these ratted computers. They record these videos and some even post them in forums or on YouTube to share with others. When a computer is controlled, it's called a slave. And hackers trade slaves, especially if they're owned by women. Equally disturbing, ratters search for sensitive pictures or videos on a slave computer and will post those publicly. Beyond the voyeuristic aspects of this, ratters like to scare slaves by displaying graphic image files on their computers or opening the DVD drive remotely. They can even make the computer read aloud using text-to-speech applications just to startle or annoy victims. You are my slave, I own your machine. This practice clearly violates computer fraud and privacy laws, but stopping ratters is no easy task. Police are up against remote attackers. The software that allows this access is freely available online, and even when ratting forums are shut down, they pop up elsewhere. While the rise of this type of hacking is scary, there are things that you can do to protect yourself. First, if your webcam has a light that goes on when it's in use, pay attention. There are entire threads in the hacking forums where ratters try to figure out how to disable those lights. But since it's not easy to do, this may be the first sign your webcam has been compromised. Next, avoid shady download sites or torrents where ratters commonly disguise their spying software as free programs, music, or videos. Finally, the basics of computer security. Install all software updates, run an antivirus program, and use a firewall. The security firms are tracking this type of intrusion, but this is a cat and mouse game. So the more you can do to make yourself a difficult target, the safer you'll be. Thanks for watching. For Yahoo News, I'm Becky Worley.